Hey, my name is Archer, and welcome to, uh, Walker. So, here's the thing. I, I, you know the footage is, uh, struggling right now. Well, I was doing some tasks trying to get this to work, because this is a, like, Unity game. So sometimes the default menus don't work. Uh, turns out this game is eating fucking 80% of my GPU. I have, for context, I have a 2060 Super, so... Dev, um, can you fix that? <laughs> I'm gonna record this, but I know you guys can't see the menu. This is a mech game where you can choose your chassis and all that fun stuff and like colors, but I'm just gonna jump into it and see what it's like and we're gonna hopefully it won't obliterate my GPU. Yeah, now now that the menu's done, it, it's fine. It went down from 90% to about. Mm. Oh no, it's still high. Okay. Ooh. I don't actually know how to play this, so bear with me. But I guess we're gonna find out. Ooh. It's like Mech Warrior, or um, not Mech Warrior, uh, Armored Core. One of my friends recommended this to me because he's like, oh, hey, you play indie games, play this. And I was like, okay. And already this is kind of fucking awesome. I don't know what to expect from this. Look at all the physics. One active from three of 999. Oh God, it's gonna be like this, huh? Should I be worrying about how much ammo I'm using? So this is for sprinting. Control does nothing, but I can use space to jump. I like how you get a little hit indicator. What What's happening over there? Nothing? It's just, uh, okay. But yeah, one of my friends recommended this to me, and I figured I'd give it a shot because it looks cool. And, oh my god, it's like a full voxel? Style? Oh no, it's just it's just hit hit locations. Okay, for a second I was genuinely thinking, oh shit, this this is like whole voxel. No wonder it's eating my computer. But uh, here let's see. There's an enemy. Critical. Ah, there's our dash meter and our flight too. So bear with me. I haven't actually really played uh, Armored Core too much, mainly because it just came out on systems I didn't own. I've seen gameplay, I've wanted to play it. I tried emulating it when I was younger, but that was a long time ago. Okay, weapon noises leave a little bit more to be desired, but okay. But it's cool. It feels really fluid. Surprisingly fluid. Honestly, and I love the little aesthetic on everything. Like, look at all this. Yeah, I assume we're going to start getting some actually uh, dangerous things soon enough. Uh, this way? Maybe? I see the little woobies. Yeah, there it is. Pew, 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 pew. I should have picked uh, other weapons. I should have customized. The only reason I didn't is because it's just mauling my GPU alive. But if it wasn't, I, I would have probably gone with like a, a shotgun or something. Because I am... I am a shotgun aficionado when it comes to video games, and I saw a super shotgun in the, uh, in the options for weapons, and along with, like, a missile launcher and a minigun, and I was like, oh, there's, like, way cooler stuff than basic rifle. You know what I mean? Also, these enemies are, um... Uh, granted, you know what? Maybe I should. Here, you know what? We'll give the game a fair shake. We'll, uh, we'll do mixed. With a map density that's heavy on a small map with um, City Knight. And then mech-wise, uh, where's weapons? I want shotgun. Yeah, see, compact shotgun. We'll take compact shotgun and then a... Oh, you can get a shield? Knuckles, too. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck yeah, shotgun and a punch. And then I have... I have missiles? Small missiles, grenades, rockets. Rockets. And we have a booster two, dynamo. What is a dynamo? I don't know what the dynamo does, but... Cool, I guess let's do this. Let's give it a shot. Oh, if the game will launch. I'm still seeing the menu on my end. Game? Oh, my encoding's try shitting the bed, but it's not like there's anything to encode. Um... Game? Fantastic. Well, this is, um... <laughs> not a good impression. 
not definitely not a good impression, but I'm willing to bear with it because it, you know, it's not like this is a triple A game here. Let me close it. We'll close and relaunch. I like to get these recordings out as like a first impressions type of thing, so I'm not going to cut or anything. We're just stuck with what we got. I'll do I'll do mixed again and then weapon rise. I want the where's the shotgun compact shotgun. Uh, I want the knuckly with I saw rockets and then the dynamo and then we can pick um, green. Cool. Let's let's give that a shot. You going to work now? If it doesn't work, I mean, I guess I'm I'm done. That's it. That's the that's the impression. You know what I mean? But I'm hoping it does. Game. You, um... Oh, there we go. Okay, okay, perfect. Ooh. Oh, that shotgun. Okay, maybe, uh... Okay, let's, uh... Iotes. I punch you. Okay, maybe I should have taken... How do I use my rockets? There's gotta be a way to use those rockets. Ooh, shit. You know, this feels... Surprisingly, I'm getting absolutely clapped. I may just be dead. Yeah, I'm just dead. Okay. <laughs> this feels surprisingly similar to MechPunk. In terms of controls. It's got that floatiness to it. Here, okay, let's... New, we'll do, instead of a knuckle, I want a focus rifle, linear rifle, rocket launchers, sniper cannon. I could be a fucking Gundam? I can, like, up the armor plating on things, too? Jesus. Plating light, medium, heavy. Oh, we're going full heavy. There's, there's no way you, rotary machine gun this time. We lose out on, uh, the rockets and all that, but that's okay. We'll take booster, too. Let's give that a shot. I'm, I'm kind of digging this. I don't know if this is going to be a commercial project. Let's see. It's just a quick and dirty boost and shooty mech game uh, uh, to cite the title blurb. It was basically the devs project to learn things in Unity, which as a learning project, this is pretty good. I'll give him credit. This this looks really good as a learning project. And it definitely feels pretty good, too, which importantly, especially for newer devs like game feel is one of the hardest things to replicate, and so far, you've done pretty good. I'd love to see this turn into a real thing. I mean, granted, everybody's waiting for Armored Core 6 as well, so perfect time. Oh, okay, Sniper Cannon's rad. Sniper Cannon absolutely fucks. Get down. Oh, that minigun. Oh, that minigun is fucking awesome. Sniper cannon, I think the... Okay. I think the lackluster, uh... The lackluster portion of this game solely just comes from the fact that the sound design's anemic. But that's just because he's learning, you know what I mean? This gameplay's actually fairly good. And uh, notoriously, I did not... I don't do tutorials in games because I like to figure it out dynamically. But so far, this feels pretty good. It feels closer to old mech games. It's intuitive, which... Again, for a dev who's learning... It's amazing. Oh, shit. Okay, hold on. Back up for a second. Let... There we go. There we go. I wish you could manually reload, but I get why you can't. Wolfhounds. Let me see if I can... Oh, this one works on overheat. I see. <laughs> For quick and dirty uh, mech game, I'm dicking this. Game breaker? Or, oh, Garm breaker. For a second, I was like, what the fuck is that? Oh, Jesus. Hey, that's not cool. You're not allowed to have missiles. I'm the only one who can have missiles. Let me stick at the minigun. Ugh, delicious. <laughs> oh, I love this thing. Oh, the minigun just kicks ass. 
The sniper cannon, not so much. It depends. But the minigun, I like... Oh, I'm down. <laughs> this is awesome. I... I really... Okay, I really hope the beeping stops. Okay. Yeah, I fucking love this. I really hope that the dev... Uh, yeah, so here, I'll read you the title blurb really quick. I know I said, um... It started as a project to learn things, make things walk in Unity. So it's called Walker, by the way. It's called Hammer for reals. But uh, BGMs are by Fox Synergy on OpenGameArt.org, and uh, Kenny's voiceover pack for the Barks. Hey, dude, if you want more Barks, I'll do some. That'd be fucking awesome. Uh, Quake and Half Life stuff in here. I hope this dev continues with this. I hope this turns into a full project. The amount of effort put into this is surprising. There's optimization issues, obviously, but like you can see it in the video footage right now, but. This feels really good. It's got like a whole weight system and stat system. It's got different armors. It's got tons of weapons, it's tons. Like I could see this turning into a full thing. Somehow figure out a way to give a online mode into this and maybe do like a mission structure. Make it like a like a co-op thing or just do PVP. I mean, whatever. I, I say co-op just cause that's, you know, it'd be fun to blow things up with friends. You could, this is totally 100% be a real game. And I, I hope it turns into something. I genuinely hope it does. Dev, dev, if you see this, I do have one request. Uh, and I say this to every dev that, you know, I run into. Uh, where is my skeleton skull head? We gotta be cool mechs. We need to be a skeleton mech. It's just a fact. It's It look fucking rad. Also, more Gundam uh, heads, please. That'd be great. <laughs> anyway, my name is Archer. I hope you enjoyed. Go check this out at the link below. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.